one of the terms used in linear programming is redundant constraint now what does that mean every constraint in LP problem forms a unique boundary of the feasible solution region for example let's say this is a graph one constraint goes like this the other one goes like this and the third goes like this and all of them are less than equal to constraints pointing to this region so in this example our feasible solution region becomes this this and this so if you note this line is contributed by this constraint this line is contributed by this constraint and this line is contributed by this constraint so all the three constraints have contributed to the boundary of the feasible solution region now let's take another example so this is another graph now the first constraint is like this second goes like this and the third is this all the three are pointing again downwards for their feasible solutions so in this case the feasible solution becomes this one and then this now the boundaries of the feasible solution region this is represented by this line and this line so this constraint here does not contribute to the boundary of the feasible solution region so what that means is that even if you omit this constraint the solution will not change so this kind of constraints which do not contribute to the boundary of the feasible solution region are known as redundant constraints